Hello, welcome back to my channel. This is Bahati's Diary of Art. Today we are meeting Silver Screen Productions. We are meeting the producer and the mix engineer. So, welcome to this episode and let's know more about Silver Screen Production. Hi. Hi. Uh, Hello. <laughs> tell us more about Silver Screen Production. Kwanza mseme ni nani kwa Silver Screen Production and what you do. Uh, my name is Jay, <coughs> aka Jay Republic. Mm -hmm. I'm the mix engineer and the videographer, graphic designer. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, Sam, aka Sam Keys, and um, I'm a producer. And, um, I'm also a photographer, but mostly I do uh, music, so I'm a producer. That's my profession. So, like, how did Silver Screen Production start? Uh, so. Take the question, Mr. Producer. <laughs> okay, Silver Screen in Lianza, um, 2020, um, I think January. We had an idea, Mimi and Jay, but to look at the on how we can start it. But to look at the idea, we can do music. Mm -hmm. Now that I'm going to keep our cool mix, na I shall wait for the studio and also have the uh, Akili ya kuunda beat mm -hmm. and uh, before ni kuja ni fike to that place I'm a keyboardist so ni kona ile staff enye naiza try kuunda beat ama ku balance the song ama ku make the beat so we came at a place to decide if to uh, something like a studio mm -hmm. so we started this studio at Ambere Towers mm -hmm. so to make up even at kona market haikopoa mm -hmm. so we decided to move here at least market. Now, to kafika penya to me fika up even. We got a support from someone. Uh, do we come and tamtaja? But uh, we got a support from someone and a little pay a bit of uh, money. Do to come and kunwa little kiasi. Do to kafika penya to me fika up. So tell us about your sounds. Who una manager ji ku fanya izo mix sounds? <coughs> is it a talent or a skill you learned? Uh, actually, it's passion. It's kind of like in the blood. So uh, my dad was actually a musician, and so it's in the blood. They say water or oh, blood is thicker than water. Mm -hmm. So yeah, the passion and then a little bit of uh, learning from experienced people. Mm -hmm. yeah, <coughs> Where did you start it? Like uli uli amua tu kwanza kwa silver production ama no, I, in the beginning, I was at Catchstone Media, mm -hmm. which was one who used to run Kitambo. I uh, was one uh, some guy, producer IC. He's a legend, and I was a producer IC. And then from there, I have worked uh, a little bit with uh, Bits Base Records, mm -hmm. you know, with uh, producer Robert Fanny. Yeah, then Wow. Mr. Producer, like who are the artists you may sign up with? Ama if they are not if there are no artists on you may sign now, who are the people that come to you in Kinanani how? Okay, for now when you to my answer, we will not sign anyone because mm -hmm. we still uh, looking to at least kumaliza bit of learning kwanza before to sign anyone. Mm -hmm. And kuna watu wamekuja sana to assign. And I think starting by next year or next month, you know, December, mm -hmm. we've been starting uh, signing people when at least to talk about Angalia when they progress. Mm -hmm. So um, for now, at the sign to it. And uh, which is the music you have based on? Kamani, Gengeton, Gospel, Ganim Ko, Apu Ivo Kapisa? We are good Kilapani. Mm -hmm. Whether Gengeton, Gospel, uh, any. To go Missouri, Kilapan. So, Hatuna to uh, like this is the best song we usually do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm talking to specify on any. No, we've not specified any. Okay. Uh, so, tell us where do you see Silver Screen Productions in the next two years, three years, five years to come? Uh, when I say seeing Silver Screen Production in two years, next, uh, uh, maybe five years uh, to come, mm -hmm. that one underestimate that word. Okay. Silver Screen is going to be big. Uh, we see it big, we see it, it's going to take the city. And Nyaka uh, Zenezanakuja, Hatutakua now, na silver screen in Yumbandogo. We will be having the big silver screen production. Yeah. And uh, tell us, where do you intend to take your 
career tu like unataka ufikie watu unajua kuna wasio unataka right now you are basing on kakamega so unataka ufikie wapi kuna mnyu unataka kufika international ama unataka tukubaki hapo you know uh, silver screen production tukianza uh, our dream was to make it a one class uh, music production unit mm-hmm. so uh, what where i see myself where we see ourselves uh, as komoja will be taking the grammys as the uh, best mix engineer or the best uh, record label mm-hmm. yeah who inspires you most like una look up to which production uh, personally i look up to specific people mm-hmm. uh, uh mike pensado uh, i think is the greatest engineer ever so i look up to him yeah. mm-hmm. and mr producer okay uh, personally i look at the laser and producer diamond mm-hmm. the beat i make Wow. So most of the beats zenye naunda za bongo mostly uh, zina end in line na yake. So huwa na motivate sana. Na hapa Kenya who are you looking forward to work with? Kuna wale ma producer nyako huko hivyo juu like mstemo mwenye unaweza tamani kufanya kazi naye ama artist mkubwa mwenye unaweza tamani kufanya kazi naye. Eh uh, huwa natamani kufanya kazi sana na producer Msiyoka. Mm-hmm. <coughs> uh, I like the his skills. Yeah, yeah, skills are can poor sana. So, who mm-hmm. anatamani sana at least if kama naweza fika to that level, inaweza kuwa vizuri sana. And uh, in the next uh, future, mna look up to ku sign artists wa gani because like okay, I'm jamaja in anything, but then na look up to ku sign ku sign na artist wa gani. Uh day is big out of the time. Uh, we, we can really, as for now mm-hmm. we can really say that we are looking to sign up to to sign artists like Mtu Flani mm-hmm. uh, we have hours we need to you know uh, yeah. part of silver screen is we, we are passionate about helping people mm-hmm. so we we won't say that to sign Mtu mwenye tayari ashajulikana uh-huh. we're going to find those talents mm-hmm. that are raw and very good and those are the ones we are hoping to bring them to expose and come to yeah and uh, apart from doing iso music production you also do voice coaching tell us about it mnaifanyaje and then plus the instruments mnafunza watu waje uh, voice coaching instrument training what mnafunza watu basing na venye wanataka kuanza because mm-hmm. when you, when it comes to uh, maybe instruments like keyboard keyboard wewe inakuwa na keys tofauti yeah. so inategemea ni mtu gani umekuja na how do you want it to be trained mm-hmm. if kama unataka ku line key moja peke yake then we shall teach you how to do that mm-hmm. but if kama unataka ku learn the whole keyboard or all instruments then we should do that so what tunapanga um, monday to friday watu wana train 2 hours per day mm-hmm. so whether it's instrument or vocal coaching like which people are you looking forward to train like new ale wale amateurs wenye wanataka kuimba ama mse yoyote tu uh tukianza kufanya hizo hiyo hiyo uh, story of voice coaching instrumental training and everything mm-hmm. what we got tunaangalia like we want to help people especially those people who are amateurs mm-hmm. so when you look at the people when at least wanajua kitu wenye wanafanya at least anajua kucheza keys and at least anajua uh, kuimba any voice huyo mm-hmm. atakuja baadaye mm-hmm. after to train amateurs because so many people are uh, yearning to learn anything so if kama tunaenda kwa watu wenye wanajua kitu wanafanya then atutakuwa tunasaidia the mm-hmm. society yeah. so by now to watch tunaangalia the amateurs at least tunatoka na umu tu chini akifika mm-hmm. kiwango fulani tunashukuru mm-hmm. yeah. me train wangapi so far so far to me train in instrument uh, to me train watu kama sita mm-hmm. but in vo- vo- uh, vocal coaching tulikuwa tunapanga time now but there's a place what na train now mm-hmm. so by now ni watu kama uh, tano wenye mm-hmm. tu train wa vocals Wow. who are the amateurs okay. yeah. uh, that is nice uh, we are hoping to do more businesses with you we are wishing you all the best mpate artists wengi and we are also wishing that silver screen production ifike mali mnataka ifike Uh, number one, put God first. No joy, there's nothing possible without God. I love for patience, persistence. It's any patience and persistence is everything. Yeah, kuwa tu patient na upasisimu siku tofika. I think kitu nyenyeza ambia mtu usi angalie usitake kuwa mtu. 
believe in yourself. Ja, try and start anything you are doing itakuwa sawa. Mimi si copy mtu but nilikuwa natamani uh, nifanye kama mtu fulani. Lakini the hard work Kenya nilikuwa nayo even fiction peke. Kanye niko hapa. In fact there was a time nilunda beat mm-hmm. nikaambiwa inapiga kelele, inapiga ndugu. Uh, si kukufa moyo. Mm-hmm. I still nili persist. <laughs> Nilipaka <laughs> zaizi. Nimefanya Kenya nafanya but let me tell you there's uh, kuna challenges in everything. Mm-hmm. So in music kuna challenges. In training anything kuna challenges. In production kuna challenges. Mtu anaweza kuja kutoa beat alafu akukwambia nataka niimbe kama uh, harmonize. Mm-hmm. Na yeye mwenyewe anaimba kama bahati kukufa. <laughs> Try. Jaribu tu uh, umsikize, make kitu anataka kusikia na persistent na patience inasaidia. But don't never give up in anything you're doing. Not only being producer but anything you want to do. Usi why give up? Uh, alafu on that note ya sauti kuna mse amekuja alafu mkamfukuza ana sauti nzuri um, anjui kuimba and to add on that mm-hmm. <laughs> hakuna haja tukule pesa yako na tukutole ngo mambaya mm-hmm. so if kama unajua unaimba vibaya utakuja yo pesa yako tuyeke tui divert kwa vocal coaching tu coach na pia ukikata kuna studio mingi mtu anezaenda kuproduce but let me tell you never produce a song na sauti mbaya hiyo tu practice on you then come back to the studio mm-hmm. if you don't practice you don't do anything so practice pray and do anything perfect in what you have uh, uh, and it comes down my praises go up yeah. and it comes down up up and it comes down my praises go up we had for you today be sure to check out my next episode of Bahati's Diary of Art until next time bye i love you all